Hi everyone, welcome to another session of GCSE Maths. In this tutorial, we're going to look at some algebraic expressions. This would be our part one. We'll look at some examples. Here we got an example. It says simplify 9c minus 7d plus c plus 3d plus 5. So how are we going to do it? We're going to collect all the like terms together, which means we'll collect all the c's together and all these d's together. And then we'll collect the numbers as well. So here we go 9c, so we put 9c there, and then we go plus c, put plus c. We add these two together, so that will be 10c. And then we'll have minus 7d, and then we go plus 3d. So we put them together, 7d plus 3d, and that will be minus 4d. And then we go plus 5. Put the expression together we'll have 10c minus 4d plus 5. So sim by simplifying this term, we'll have 10c minus 4d plus 5. Next example, it says expand 4 times 3y plus 5. We'll have to expand this one. So how we can do it, how we can do is, so we'll have to multiply this term by this and then this term by this we'll have 4 times 3y plus which is this plus 4 times 5 so if we can multiply them we'll have 4 times 3 12y plus 4 times 5 will be 20 example number 3 Expand 3b squared times 2b cubed plus 3b. So we'll multiply this one by this one and this one by this one. 3b squared times 2b cubed, which is these two. We'll have 3 times 2, which is this one times this one. And then we go b squared, which is b squared there, b cubed, b cubed there. So 3 times 2, which is 6, times b squared, times b cubed. So when you go times, we have to remember, you have to add the power here. So that will be 6 times b to the power 5. Answer will be 6 b to the power 5. Now, this one, times this one, 3b squared times 3b, that will be... So we've got 3 times 3 times by b squared, which is this b squared, times by b. So 3 times 3 is 9. b squared times b would be b cubed. So you go power 2 and then you go power 1 would be b cubed. So answer is 9 b cubed. Now, 3 b squared times 2 b cubed plus 3 b. So if we put these two terms together, so that will be 6 b to the power 5 plus 9 b cubed. So this is our answer. Now expanding two brackets. So here we go two bracket x plus 2 and y plus 3. So how we're going to do it is we'll multiply the outer term first. So this one times this one, and then we'll have this time, this one times this one, this one times this one, and then this one times this one. So we'll have x time y equals to x y. X times three would be three x. Two times y would be two y. Two times three would be six. So x plus two, and then y plus 3 would be xy plus 3x plus 2y plus 6. So this is our answer.
now this one is much harder so here we go three brackets so you'll have to expand them and then you have to simplify so how can we do it is uh, we're going to expand two brackets first and then we'll do the other one so here we go y plus 4 times y plus 5 so if we expand so what you have to do is we have to multiply this one times by this one and this one times by this one this one times by this one and then this one times by this one so we'll have y times y y times y then y times 5 and then we go 4 times y then we go 4 times 5 so our answer would be y times y would be y squared y times y would be 5y 4 times y would be 4y and then 4 times 5 would be 20 so if we simplify further we'd have y squared so 5y plus 4y would be 9y plus 20 so expanding these two terms we got this one so now what we have to do is um, we have to multiply this one times by this one so we go 2y plus 1 which is from here and then we go y squared plus 9y plus 20 so now we'll have to multiply this one times by this one this one times by this one this one times by this one and we'll have to multiply this one times by this one this one times by this one and this one times by this one so we'll have 2y times y squared which is this 2y times 9y which is this and then we go 2y times 20 which is this and then we'll have to multiply this term by 1 so that will be 1 times y squared which is this then 1 times 9y which is this and then 1 times 20 will be this so now we go we need to simplify 2y times y squared would be y cubed 2y times 9 would be 18 and then y times y would be y squared so that would be 18y squared 2 times 20 would be 40 and then you go y 40y then 1 times y squared would be y squared 1 times 9y would be 9y plus 20 now we're going to collect the like terms so that will be 2y cubed there is no other y cubed on this one and then we go 18y squared and we go another y squared there so that will be 19y squared 40y plus 9y would be 49 and then we go plus 20 so expanding these three brackets together our answer would be this yeah so that's it from me for today if you guys got any question please ask in the comment box and please subscribe for next video and uh, thank you for watching